Hello again and we're going to have a game of Gauntlet for the Handstrad CPC this time. Um, this was an absolutely brilliant game I thought way back um, in the 80s um, when I played this. I did play this on the Commodore 64 first but when I had it on the Amstrad I honestly thought this was a very good version too. Um, US Gold again doing some games right for the Amstrad at least. Um, so not all their games are bad <laughs> for the Amstrad. Um, here we go. So nice colourful graphics for a start. Um, colourful stripe sprites. Um, plays very very well this game. I really did enjoy this. We're not going to go to the exit because we're going to, as far as I remember, um, there was um, you could skip at least about six or eight levels. So so we're going to try and find. Oh, that's an exit four, but I'm sure this must be something behind this door. Why are all these ghosts here? Then it's got to be something being well protected. So, gonna fight through our gut, fight through this, and go through. Watch them all come along. So they all chase you. Um, food restores your energy or your health, rather. Same thing, really. As we exit eight, so we skip eight levels. There we go, straight onto level eight. This was a really, really, really good two-player game because basically you can basically just keep on playing this game. Once um, you die, you, the other person keep going, but you can just keep coming back to life. Um, really, really good game. Really played this for such a long time with my mate, and also on the Commodore 64 version too. Um, oh, never completed this game. Never did. So, I don't know, so many levels. Uh, it was always fun to play. Um, either version. I've only played it on the Amstrad and the Commodore 64. Um, great. Absolutely great. Well, watch these black things. Um, I presume they do knock your energy right down. And they're really hard to kill. Um, so what are the little square things are bases, so uh, there's a little potion here, so you pick that up, you get your own energy put up back 100 points. Um, so, <laughs> oh it's the exit, yes go to the exit, get out of here. So find the potion, so what does that do? I know he did something, um, oh bloody hell, this one looks a little bit tougher. <laughs> Uh, so I think that's just gold, just bumps up your score. Um, yeah, get but bumps it up by 100 points to each gold. Yeah, it's not luck because when you die, you do. I think you lose your score. So, um, but interesting thing is, if you've got keys and stuff like that, the other part, the other player can pick that all up, so they get all the keys. If you're playing two player. So you don't lose your stuff, which is a very good touch to the game I thought. Really is a really good fun game. Um, can get very difficult as I say, but if you if you keep both players like at least you've got one player alive when the other one dies then you can just keep carrying on playing. <laughs> That's why I really like this game and believe me. It's got so many levels in this game, it's worth it. Um, yeah, I'm, it's a shame that I ain't got no one to play this because you know I like to keep my reviews short, but it would be nice to have a, a two player game with someone again because that, that would be good fun, I think. But I like to keep my reviews as short as possible, but try and get a good game out of it. <laughs> but our energy's right down to at least down to three out of. 300 now so so we took a took a bit of a battering going for all that lot but now I don't know where the fuck I'm going so um, obviously I must have to get to one of those teleporters because there's the exit on the other side of the wall um, no I shoot my way through here no because some of them bricks you can shoot through like these ones they shoot through those bricks and here's the teleporter so Go through that and I'm gonna tell it. Oh shit! Um, oh my god, they just. Ah, that's it. Dead. Ah, that was really, really enjoyable to play that again. 
really brought back a lot of memories that did all good <laughs> um, so we enter our name okay I've done that so now what do I do um, no idea obviously there must be a fault somewhere bug with this emulator emulate this game this disc but no oh well anyway I've got a game out of it Thank you for watching, until next time, and goodbye.